An Athens educator convicted in a school fraud scheme wants a new trial. Rick Carter's motion comes just days after a federal jury in Montgomery convicted him. Let's go to Way 31's Nikel Williams now with a look at why Carter says he's due a new trial. Nikel? Rick Carter will be back in court for a virtual hearing next week on his motion for a new trial. Carter alleges two key witnesses lied on the stand about his involvement in the multi-million dollar scheme where two former school superintendents pleaded guilty. He also says he deserves a new trial because a forensic accountant who testified for the prosecution could not link him to any flow of money related to the scheme. Carter says what the government did prove was that his that he simply handled fraudulent student data and helped to put it in a database. Carter's attorneys say that does not elevate him to a knowing willful conspirator. Prosecutors wrapped up their 24 page motion with the question, who enters into a multi-million dollar conspiracy for zero money? It'll be up to the federal judge who presided over Carter's trial and resulting guilty verdict to decide if he gets a new trial. If a new trial does, uh, if she does grant a new trial, then the next jury will only be tasked with considering the seven counts of conspiracy and fraud that Carter was convicted of back on March 21st. Without a new trial, Carter is, set, Carter is set to be sentenced on June 30th. In studio, Nikhil Williams, Way 31 News.